So in today's video, I'm going to talk a little bit about a problem that can happen with your chicks, and it's called crooked toe. This is a new one for me. Uh, we've had some problems with this batch of chicks. Um, four, I think, out of the five have had pasty butt, and not just once, I mean multiple times. And there's had to be some intervention with cleanup and whatnot uh, in order to kind of keep them functioning, but they are all doing well and growing, which is good. Uh, but um, I noticed that one of the chickens, the gate was off. Every now and then it seemed like it was staggering. So I figured there must be something wrong. So I picked them up and looked at it and uh, realized that its toes were actually crooked. They were curved. So normally a chicken's feet has three toes and kind of a thumb like this and they kind of splay outwards like that and that's how they walk on the ground but what happens is that in crooked toe is that the toe is actually actually turned and it's actually laid flat on the ground and they splay outwards and sometimes it can be really really severe in our case it was only kind of the i guess the index toe and the and the middle toe so upon looking online, I realized that the, the fix was pretty simple using uh, bandages. Here's the fix. So we have these bandages that now splay the toes apart. So it's in that kind of three toe configuration that you expect for a chick. So uh, that's just stuck on there on the bottom and it's stuck over the top and then in between the toes to kind of keep them apart. Um, and we noticed immediately that when we put her down into the brooder, um, she was actually running around really, really fast. I'm hoping that, that this is a simple fix. So my understanding is you leave this on for a few days and then you check it. This is our chick with the crooked toe. Walking normal. and can easily get away if it wanted to. Um, just choosing not to right now. But yeah, so I'm hoping that this is gonna be the fix. So that's crooked toe. And uh, that's the fix. Some bandages, splay the toes apart, and it's all good. So we'll check back in a few days now and see how this little one made out. All right, so today I have to do an inspection on this chick that has a crooked toe. Um, so I could see kind of what shape feet are in. And uh, it looks like, I mean, they're, they're still a little bit crooked, but they don't look as bad as what they were. So um, I'm going to actually get this bandage off and we're going to put a new bandage on it. All right, so today I have my daughter with me, Katie. Katie, say hi. Hi. So she's the veterinary assistant while I take off the bandages from the chick that has the crooked toe. I'm just gonna work my way across the bandage here. Uh, some of it might be a little bit stuck. So uh, I'm gonna use some ingenuity here to, to get this stuff off. Might take a while. All right, so we've removed the bandages. You can see now that toe is still a little bit crooked, but for the most part, they're all lined up, I think, the way that they should be. So I think that we're good. Hopefully the toes will stay like it. If not, we'll apply bandages again. The one with the crooked toe here it has the bandages off. They've been on now for about a week. It's not as bad as what it was before. Uh, but they are still turning in a bit without the splint. Uh, luckily, they did straighten out a bit, so we may add another bandage. So here's the bandage job. Um, the chick, so this is the second round of bandages now. It actually looks a lot better than what it was, but uh, I think maybe another couple of days and uh, should do the job. So we'll check back in a few days, take these bandages off and see, uh, see how it looks. So this little one is the one with the crooked toe. It's quite big now. It's been off about a week and 
You can see that middle toe here is still turning in a bit, but overall it's way, way better than what it was. And uh, this toe, at least on this foot, is actually looking really, really good. So I'm quite pleased. So that's crooked toe. Keep, uh, you know, the foot bandaged for, you know, a week or two and inspect it and rebandage if necessary. And for the most part, um, it fixes itself. I'm quite pleased. Um, this little one now is uh, probably going to live a pretty normal life. Uh, but beforehand, the toes were pretty crooked. So um, although they can live normal lives, uh, I'm sure that this is going to make it a lot easier.